So this is a game we like to call the Pop Buzz Confession Booth. Now what you're going to do is you're going to enter our literal Pop Buzz Confession Booth and you are going to be asked a series of questions. You're just going to have to give us the honest answers that are deep within your oh, yeah. heart. State your name, my child. Joseph Sugg. When did you last come to confess? Um, uh, I haven't. <laughs> ever. Take it away. I will leave you to interrogate the subject. What was your first email address? My first email address was jackassjoe <laughs> at hotmail.co.uk. Wow. A reference to the TV show? Yes. Or, right, okay, I fair enough. I used to think I was Johnny Knoxville. Good. That's worth clarifying, <laughs> isn't it? Yeah, when yeah. you got jackass an email address, like, no, it is the TV show. It's yeah. okay. What is your guilty pleasure song? I'm really into 80s music. It's Bando. Yeah, <laughs> it's Bando by then. Duran Duran. Uh, Duran Duran, like all, all of them. Um, Toto. Oh, oh, nice. Oh, yes. Toto Africa. Oh. Big shout. Okay, who was your first YouTube crush? Ooh. I don't really. I don't really have any. You I've never really. Liar. I've never really fancied any YouTubers. He has sinned. <laughs> <laughs> um, what is your biggest YouTube pet peeve? When people say, "Give this video a thumbs up," it really helps me out. It doesn't. <laughs> thumbs up don't actually mean I've anything. It's just like a that. visual thing. It's not. It doesn't help you out. Which YouTuber are you most jealous of? Um, I would have to say. Zoella. Oh. oh. Now, just, just in general life or she's, in the YouTube she's community? Just the, she's just the, the better sug, you know? Oh. And that's, not, that's not what my family said. That's not what my parents said. That's somewhat heartbreaking. That really is. <laughs> my dad this definitely is... didn't say that. All right. What's the biggest lie you've ever told? I'll always remember when I was in primary school, but it's not, it's not a big lie. But uh, I smashed a pot and uh, me and my friend at the time, Still my friend. So no, I said at the time, we're still friends. <laughs> Me and my friend decided to play basketball in the corridor where this pot was, and I threw it and smashed the pot. And to this day, I don't think the teacher ever found out who it was. There Sorry, it is. Sorry, Mrs. Hollingsworth. <laughs> <laughs> okay. When was the last time you pooped your pants? Um, God, I need to know. Do you know what? Genuinely, we all need to know. I, I have massive pride in this. It wasn't since I was like. I reckon four or five. Nice. Hundred nice. percent. I remember because yeah. I, I had. I had, I had this is uh, just raising more questions about Father Woody in the corner. I think than it does. Lies. Everyone does it regularly. It was in my, it was in my Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles pants. Oh, oh man, it's like a boulder. Look, that's a very <laughs> visceral. <laughs> very <laughs> visceral. You said it was confessional. A hero <laughs> in a half shell, right there. There he is. <laughs> Who was the last person you unfollowed on social media? I bulk get rid of people. And then some, and then I did it on Facebook as well. I got rid of a load of people on my Facebook. Um, it is the most satisfying thing. The weird thing, thing though, is they read you, as if, oh, as, really? as, if as if you've done it on, by accident. Oh, and it's like, no, I've got I've, I've got rid of, rid of you for a reason. Oh, that's I sound really harsh, don't I? No, no, no. <laughs> there is, I maintain there is nothing more satisfying than a good Facebook call. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Is, you just feel cleansed afterwards. <laughs> you yeah. really do. I'm I had, not sure if mine have ever added me back, though. Like, <laughs> like, like, everyone has me back and they're like, hi, Joe, I just noticed that you've unfollowed me. Um, <laughs> maybe it was a mistake. I was like, no, I genuinely have just got rid of you. Oh, that's I, an awkward like, message to We received. had one math class together in like year nine. Like, <laughs> I, don't, I don't actually Bye. know you as a person anymore. That's fair. Okay, have you ever sent a screen grab to the wrong person yeah a lot of, a lot of the time <laughs> mainly, <laughs> but mainly it. like worse though i've sent a lot of like texts to the wrong people yeah that's it mm -hmm. like yeah it's, it's not or screen grabs of a conversation you've had where you've been moaning or, about someone and, and then, then you send, send it on to that WhatsApp, person on whatsapp i have to always double check i even though i know it's in the right chat i always then delete it look and check the chat again make sure it's the right chat and then send it through <laughs> what was the last phone call you avoided Last phone call I avoided was from my mum. No! Oh, no. no! I know, sorry, mum. It was a bad time. I Well, actually, no, I'd just woken up. <laughs> and I was like, I could accept this call, but then... Like, she won't get any sense out of me because I'm still half asleep. They always know, don't they, the yeah. parents? They always know if you've just yeah. woken up, no matter what time of day it is. Like, Mum, don't time. call yeah. before 4 p.m. Absolutely. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> you get the drill. All right, I think you survived the confession booth. Well done, yeah, Joe. Well done. You.